said, I always said that I imagined this convening as a, in the style of a family reunion. You know, when we come together to honor a particular thread of heritage, a particular thread of tradition, uh, because we have a connection to one of our many surnames, and we're gathering around that right there. And when we go to a family gathering, one of the things that, and especially a family reunion, one of the great gifts is we get to meet people we didn't know we were connected to. Today, the Maria Irene Bornes Institute Symposium is a manifestation of an intention, of an idea that was spoken, that was conceived and spoken aloud by Lisa Cortes and Lou Moreno back in 2013 in Boston to which Brian Herrera committed himself, and along with Ian Garcia Romero, Vidalia Cruz, Georgina Escobar, and Abigail Vega, has led the way from taking this idea, this manifestation, this presence, all of us here together, and it's quite astonishing. As I really start to think about how we treat our visionaries, how we treat our visionaries. Irene is still alive. She's a visionary. And Irene trained other visionaries. And Irene trained other women who are visionaries. And I really do feel like, if we're gonna talk about familia and being a family, I really do think that we need to look to those visionaries and, and take care of them and produce their damn work and make sure that they're okay. Like I always think about her voice when I teach. And her, she had a tiny little Cuban accented voice that was just, with that, as small as it was, it was fierce. So I think about all that energy that she brought with her into the teaching, into the teaching, into the classroom. I, I never studied with her, but I certainly was influenced by her work. And I think uh, at that point in New York, she was certainly one of the most influential playwrights. I wish she still were, um, but she's a remarkable presence in American theater. The Fortinez Institute's mission is to celebrate, to amplify, to elevate, elevate, to archive, to preserve, to make more visible the living legacy of Irene Fortinez. What is your impulse coming out of today? Is there anything you'd like our witness, our support, and our validation as you carry this impulse forward in your own practice and in your own communities?